welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new my name is lauren starting off the vlog in front of the christmas tree and i wanted to start off this video with a princess polly winter haul so excited to share these pieces with you guys i got some really good basics that are perfect for every day work dress up dress down and then also some really fun pieces before we get into the haul i did want to mention that princess polly offers free U.S. shipping on orders $50 or more and shop pay and after pay to allow more flexibility with your purchasing. So let's get into the haul. So I've been really focusing on basics this season. It's easy to layer basics, dress up, dress down, and you can kind of wear them so many different ways. So I got a couple basic style pieces in this haul to share. So first I got this bodysuit with a really low cut open back. It is stunning, comes in multiple different colors. This is one of the softest material shirts I have ever felt. Almost kind of like a jersey style, very stretchy, but also hugs you in all the right spots. You can obviously layer this um, and you can even wear it into spring because it's a great material that's also very lightweight, but you can layer over top of it with a jacket of some sort, dress it up, wear it out. Also love when bodysuits have a detachment part right here. Kind of makes it easier to put on and take off. So got this, really love the open back. Next, I got this basic black tee. It's like a scoop-ish square style neckline, really flattering. And what I like about it too is that it's a little bit warmer of a basic because it is double lined across the chest and the back part, but still allows it not to be too hot because on the sleeves, it is only single lined. So it's perfect for winter and layering for those colder days, but also not feeling restricting or making you too hot. So I love this, perfect for work, dressing up, dressing down. This is like one of those perfect basics that I feel like you need in your closet. It does come in multiple colors too, but I thought black was perfect. You can never have too many black basics. So I got this. So this next one is a little bit warmer of a style top. It's cropped and it buttons up the front. Thought you could kind of wear this multiple ways just because of the buttons. You can kind of open the buttons all the way up and kind of wear it off the shoulder a little bit. I like how it's cropped so it hits really nicely where a pair of jeans would sit. You can kind of tuck it up, make it more cropped. It's warmer because it's thicker, kind of like a sweater style top thought this was the perfect basic to have but it's not just a plain style basic because it has that button detailing and it is a ribbed style top so really love this the lighting keeps changing in here because the sun keeps moving but next we're getting into sweaters i really love this style sweater and i don't have anything like it i loved the collared detailing thought this would be super cute for work too it has kind of balloon style sleeves but then fitted right here and it will hit right where my high-waisted pants hit so you can kind of tuck it a little bit in to the high-waisted pants and wear a tank top underneath it if it hits a little bit too low cut super warm style sweater and i just love this collar style that's been really in lately so wanted to pick this up this wouldn't be a Lauren Princess Polly haul without a matching comfy set of some sort. I feel like I always gravitate towards sets and I've mentioned this before in previous Princess Polly hauls. I love sets. You can wear them multiple different ways, pair them together, pair them separately so you can get multiple different outfits out of them. I got this brown comfy sweater set with these shorts. They are sold separately, which I like because sometimes when it comes to sets, you want the top and the bottom to fit differently. So with this, since they are sold separately, you can purchase different sizes. This would also be perfect for work too. I love getting clothes that I can kind of wear at home and in the office. Makes my wardrobe a little bit more versatile. So I've got the sweater and then the shorts kind of styled differently. You can wear a sweatshirt over top of it. You can also wear a longer t-shirt and you can even wear it into spring because they are shorts. So love this, love a two-piece set. Makes it really easy getting dressed when you have stuff like this to go together. 
been really in to navy blue this winter season and i got this sweater dress which i don't have anything like this and i'm really excited to style this so it's kind of like a turtleneck -y style but it's not a thick turtleneck i don't love when turtlenecks feel like it's just like suffocating you and it's just all around here and get frustrating to wear so i love this style because it's not super hugging to the neck and it's not super thick and it's a great length i am 5'2 for reference i was thinking that this would be perfect to dress up or dress down i do have my work holiday party coming up this week and i think i might wear this with some booties so love this super cute for winter this i'm so excited about because i love how trench coats are in and this is one of those perfect trench coats that's not too heavy i do live in florida so i wanted something that i could definitely wear during the winter time because it doesn't get super super cold here and if it is cold it's cold for like a day or two and then it gets back up to like 75 80. so this is really lightweight of a trench coat which i love it's a great material great fabric but you can also size up so you can layer underneath it more i thought this would be perfect for honestly like a full black outfit underneath dress up dress down you can wear it with leggings long Long sleeve sneakers for a dress down look or dress it up with some jeans leather pants and wear it out so cute great length great material so perfect and I'm so excited to style it for winter the next thing I got is something for New Year's I don't have any New Year's plans yet but I always love dressing up feeling festive for New Year's wearing sparkles glitter and Princess Polly has so many different New Year's options on their site from like sparkly tops to dresses so you can really find something for any type of new year's party or thing that you're doing i got this really pretty dress i love the little added detail it has a slit on the side and you can kind of tighten it and loosen it on this side depending on how you want it to fit on your hip really love how it's long sleeve so if it is cold on new year's here in orlando i have something at least covering my sleeves and also the sleeves are not double lined so they're a little bit thinner too and then the whole entire main part of the dress is double lined so love this kind of has a mock-ish style neckline so cute for new year's and i can't wait to wear it and that concludes the princess poly haul you guys already know that i have a coupon code for you we'll get you 20 percent off your order at princess poly it is love lauren 20 i'll put it right here on the screen gets you 20 percent off your new winter wardrobe thank you again princess poly for working with me on today's video Hope you guys enjoyed this winter haul. I'm drinking a cranberry fizz poppy and I wanted to open up day nine of the Alma calendar. Also, just quickly wanted to share some of the stuff that I received this past week. I feel like this isn't one of my favorite advent calendars. It does allow me to kind of try different brands that I haven't tried before or one I haven't heard of. So first got this really pretty red nail polish. Super goop, unseen. I don't like this for my face. Kind of like clogs my pores. So I'll probably only use this on my neck area. The Sunday Riley CEO Glow Vitamin C Moisturizer. I've been using this and I think I like it. Probably not gonna notice a difference by the little travel size, but it's nice to have like a switch up of a moisturizer. And then two different perfumes. This one smells really good. It's Salt by Ellis Brooklyn. Definitely different than what I, something I've ever tried before. And I like how this one is a rollerball. I feel like with travel size perfumes or something like this small, it needs either a rollerball or just like a little spray. So I really like how this one's a rollerball. And then this one I've been actually wanting to try and smell for a long time because I feel like it's been around for a while. It's been very popular throughout the years and it's the vanilla. I don't even know who this is by if I'm being honest, but I know it's sold at Anthropology. It's a little sweet for me. Um, it does last all day, which is great. I wore it. I wore it the past two days to work, and whenever I'd like move my arm or like move my sweater, I could smell it on me. So I like it. It just kind of smells like cake batter or like something like that and i don't always like to have that as a scent on me would be good to honestly layer with like a different scent as well maybe like another like warm ish maybe like an amber perfume so 
that. And that's, that's what I got this week. So day nine. Got, oh, this I'm really excited to try. It's the Tan Lux, the face self-tanning drops, illuminating self-tanning drops. I am a Lux Unfiltered girl, tried and true. I love all of Lux Unfiltered's products. They're my favorite. And I love the self-tanning drops for your face, but I've always wanted to try the Tan Lux one. But once I find something I like, it's really hard for me to kind of branch out sometimes, especially when it comes to self-tanners. Once I find something I like, I usually stick to it. Plus this is really pricey, the bigger bottle. So, and I don't even, they don't sell I don't know if they even sell travel size, but I would hate to go out and purchase it, try it, and hate it. So I'm really excited to try this, and this is like the perfect little tester to try and really see if you like the product. But yeah, wanted to open up day nine. It's Sunday. I just picked up a quick Target pickup order with some things that we needed for the week for groceries. Not a lot of stuff. We didn't need really anything, which is always nice when you can kind of save one week on groceries and not really have to spend any money on food. Christian's sister and niece just got into town for Disney. They drove up from South Florida and they're just staying with us tonight and then they're gonna head closer to the parks for tomorrow and the next couple of days. I don't know how many days they're actually staying, but um, when people think Orlando, they think Disney, and Disney is actually like 30, 35-ish minutes from where we live, and um, same with like downtown Orlando is like 30 minutes from Disney. So I don't really categorize necessarily Orlando with Disney just because it's so far. I mean, it's not like, super far but it's not right in my backyard if that makes sense so they're here for the next couple of days and i'm so excited to have them into town we haven't seen them in a couple of months i think so it's nice to have them and we're going to a ucf basketball game at four o'clock and then we're going to disney springs to go to dinner at the boathouse and then like walk around and look at the christmas lights i am really excited about that because i really wanted to do something like festive or see christmas lights this weekend and next weekend's like the last weekend before christmas so really wanted to do something festive and fun and i'm excited that we get to do that i need to get a new car mount so bad it's gonna one time really mess up my camera if i keep just using the same car mount i need to really just order one on amazon but what i was saying is i just wanted to update the vlog um sorry i've been so mia um i'm gonna head inside and we're gonna get ready for the ucf basketball game go do that go to disney springs look at all the christmas lights have dinner just spend time with christian's family that we don't get to see that often because they live like three and a half hours away so mm -hmm. 